Legend of Total War here with part 50 of my Total War Attila Let's Play campaign as the Huns. On the last episode, it was pretty much all consumed by a defensive attack by... What are these guys called again? Atropatine? Uh, at Sinope. I haven't been able to raise the settlement to the ground yet, because these guys still need to replenish. Um, is there a garrison here? Should be... How the fuck? Did they get a full load of garrison in there instantly? We just eradicated them. And the city's not damaged. What have they got here? They got sheep barn. God, I should have eradicated it in the first place. So I recruited some new units. Um, I do think we need to remain... In, we, we don't really have a choice. We'll have to remain encamped here. Okay, uh, so we'll have to start merging a few units. Because obviously, as you can see here, we got the shit kicked out of us a little bit. Not quite as badly as they got it done to them, the enemy. Okay, how many can we recruit in one turn? Wait, you're... Wait, where's the guy? You leveled up to this. So you can actually recruit plus two, so that's five. Five units can be recruited, so merge them. Okay, we want one of these, four of these. As you can see, as we start merging the um, the Hunnic mounted bows, we'll eventually have none of them left. Eventually we'll be left with just Hunnic horse archers, which are better, but of course you can see the sheer difference in, in uh, cost. But that's okay, it's not the end of the world if we're Paying money. Um, I'm tempted to force march him back over here. It's just that these guys here might attack, so maybe we should just stay put. Because I don't think they're at war. That being said, let's go into diplomacy and see if these guys are ready to go to war with Welcome. any one of my enemies. Specifically the Sassanids. No. So, the guys that like me, I'm not at war with. Mostly just at war with Sassanid Empire vassals. Yes. I think we need to get rid of this guy here. Actually, it was the other one we need to get rid of, but whatever. So, Gay is wounded. That's something. And don't we have a champion here? Wants you to assassinate this guy. 50% odds. See if you can do it. Good. Killed it. Got another guy over here. See if we can get lucky. The moderate chances of success. Toss of a coin, really. It's okay, wounded. Gets him out of there. That's good. Alright, so you. You've also been misdirected or something. Kind of want you to make your way down to down to Iconium a little bit. If you could just hang out over here and in camp. We'll merge these two. Yep, and then just recruit someone to replace it. Just the Hunnic Horse Archers. I don't, I don't really care much for those units. It doesn't matter that much. The Horse Archers are the pride of the Huns. Okay, still need to be seeing what's going on over here. Uh, if you can get rid of this spy for me, that would be great. Can we go four for four? Oh, I got wounded. It's alright. This guy here got an upgrade. That's good. That'll make him a little bit better. Yes, one well, definitely increased chances of killing enemies. Good. Okay, so it's autumn, so... Alright, up here. These guys will need to get into different provinces, and then... Wait for winter out. Wait until winter's run out. Okay, so where's, where's the line? It's somewhere around here. Ah, shit. That's Hrafen's Holt. That's Hafen. Okay, you come down to Hafen. 
to stay put there. Uh, these units here, let's merge a few, just re-recruit. Go... Let me see. Just looking at the difference between these two units. I mean, their missile attack is... Oh, sorry, their... Uh, the melee attack is a little bit better. Morale's not quite as good. You know what? See, these guys here, their melee damage is actually higher than the Step Raiders. But they do have a better charge bonus. And they're better in melee defense. But they're not that much better. Probably better off just going with these. Okay, you. By standard march. Need to remain in this territory. Stay there. Ready for more orders. Okay, and then these guys can attach to you. Let's just see if it increases their uh, replenishment. So you're currently at eight men per turn. And it now goes to... Makes no difference. What about you? So you're at eight men per turn. This is a better agent. And you've gone up to... Made no difference at all. Okay, whatever. Let's get rid of these. Mercenary step lances with. They won't merge. Whatever. I can merge these two then. I can merge them. Okay. Let's see. What can we recruit here? Yeah, get one of these. Why not? And you come down here. And we need to punish the Saxons for betraying us. Hey, you want to do me a favor and get rid of this guy? Failed utterly. Okay, your turn. Try and get rid of them. And he got wounded. Whatever. Ass weasel. Okay then. It's still the east over here, the steps. But then we'll be fighting armies that are quite similar to our own. Okay, so this army here. Let's see. Um, I don't want you attached to them. Because you're probably going to slow them down. Let's see. As far as they can move at the moment is... Let's see. Where is it? There. If we took you out... Oh, hang on. These guys can move to here. If we took him out... They can move all the way down to Sumium. Which is owned by... Abaskia. Ab uh, If we come all the way down here, we're not going to be able to encamp. We'll be able to attack them next turn, even though it's winter. Just come down here firstly. Let's see what they've got. Because these guys are a strong faction, but I doubt they would have dedicated many resources to doing this. They haven't bothered to do anything. Not a thing. I guess there's no rush on eradicating it then. Bring me my hmm, I'm worried that there's a lot of enemies around here. We should come up here on the other side of the river and encamp. And while you're at it, start merging some of these guys. Right, and then just get replacements. Incomes coming in, looking good. Okay, I believe a term of office, yep, ended. So this guy, plonk him there. We're in the respectable range, so that's good. How's your influence, Attila? 101. You failed like three times already to get a wife, so you can just forget about it. You can just keep raping concubines or whatever. I don't give a shit. What are the Sassanids gonna do? Hopefully they're still at war with those other motherfuckers. Yep. And the Allens as well. The Allens have actually grown really strong. Good and noble friend. What an honor you do us. 
Come speak and let us hear your we arranged a marriage. Nah, I find that to be useless. Whatever. Not gonna work while well. I'm completely unreliable. Anyway, let's move on to... Oh, hang on, what about buildings? Alright, so this one here can get a new something. Uh, Food-wise, you're a little bit low. Got the bartering grounds here. What if we upgrade that? We get 12... Uh, 10, uh, 10, uh, extra 5% wealth from industrial buildings, which is pretty good. Food's a little low. Yeah, we'll go with food. Because going, going out of food can be a big problem. Okay, and you guys looking fine. You can't build anything. You. What's this? Communal ground. Yep. Go with that. Can upgrade this, but I wouldn't worry about it. Can upgrade food. I wouldn't worry about that either. Okay, let's move on to the next turn. Don't forget, we still need another, I think, four armies in order to get a divine victory. Four armies with full stacks. Someone just... Is... Oh, I don't know. Seems like the Sassanids are preoccupied. Which is good, gives me, gives me time to eradicate them in Anatolia. Oh, come on. I just want to be left alone. I don't like these. I want to be, you know, um, invading territories, not consistently defending myself. Well, we have to fight this because we need to stay encamped. Luckily, it's a river crossing battle. But they do have some artillery, but that doesn't really concern me too much. Let's just have a look what it looks like. Yep, yeah, alright, let's do this. Okay. Uh, let me just check something. Okay, all good. Um, don't know where they're going to be coming from, but it doesn't matter. You guys hang back. You guys get over there. They need to stay in loose formation because artillery is going to be firing. And they've got a lot of it. Okay. You guys, cross over here, kill the enemy general who's stupidly put over there. That's really, really dumb of them. And you guys, uh, just hang back for now. Go hide. If you go hide, they can't shoot you. Okay, I want you to be heavy shot. And when we get close, we'll use this. As Actually, use this. Come on, let's speed it up. Keep forgetting about that. That's that's really quite useful. If I can move 50% faster, it makes their speed 142. Why would I want devil archers when I can use these? I don't know. We'll see. Guys, just watch the friendly fire. That's all I have to say. Use this. Position shot. Make sure you do as much damage to them as possible. I want the guy dead. They're trying to cross. He's not going to last too long. Okay, stop shooting. Don't waste your ammunition. Wait until they stop. Charge him. Oh, we're tired. That's okay. We should easily be able to break him, though. All those horses converging onto him should be easy.
Okay, our guys over here are still hidden, and they'll remain hidden for a while. You guys come over here. Don't forget, they do have cavalry. Are we done? I think so. Start coming in over here. You guys have to go flaming shot. Get ready to take out these uh, cavalry. I'm starting to really like these units here. Primarily because of that ability right there. It's really useful. And it might be time to start upgrading all of all of my other units to Hunter Horse Archers. Because obviously, because I use them in big batches, and obviously if I've got ones that don't have it, then I can't click it. And there's no point having clicking some of them, they all need to stay together. Gee, you burned out that forest really quickly. Don't do anything though. Gotta take it down. There's no need to eradicate them completely, I'm just looking to win. Yeah, come over here. Go fire at will. Uh, use a uh, flaming shot. Make them terrified of us. Good. Keep smashing them. Hopefully they'll break soon. Come in, you're gonna shoot or not? Oh crap, crap, crap. Trying to keep an eye on the other thing, and then this guy got too close. Good, you got him. Don't think we lost any men on that particular charge. That's good. How are we going over here? Burning down their artillery. There's really no point in running any of them down. Because they're just going to come back and bother us another day. We're not going after their territory, so what does it matter? Try to do this without taking too many casualties. Come on, get out of there. There we go, let you do it. Good. Alright, just let them get out of there, and... Now what? They don't have much over here. Should be easy to take them down. I don't want to cross the river while these guys are a bit close. But I will hold this other side of the river. They're not getting across. Especially when these guys come in there. Shoot the living shit out of them. Looks like we've got a mass rout. Oh, uh, you know what? When you get a, see a big fucking rout like that, you've just got to go in and have some fun. Because if we don't at least do some damage to them, then they'll just come straight back for us. So yeah, come run them down. And also, it'll give us some experience. Let these guys go back to their homeland and tell of the ass whooping that they received at the hand of the Huns. You gotta love a mass rat like that. That's what we're all about. Fear. Fear is the main conqueror of men. Ah, uh, that'll do. So we lost a grand total of 10 men. Probably from friendly fire. But that went pretty well. We didn't kill their onages though. They got away. Who cares?
Good, I don't think we'll be seeing them for a while. And they'll, they've probably actually helped me replenish some of my army. You guys can just fuck off. Go back where you came from. Useless gits. Uh, they're not done with this yet, apparently. I was worried that this might happen. Okay. Hmm. Okay, well, we got a lot of horse archers. I'm not particularly confident of victory. But of course we have to fight this or else... Um, we don't have to, but... The thing is, if they've got a lot of camels... The thing is, if we go in here and we fight, and things look like it's going to shit, we withdraw, we get all of our ammunition back. If we withdraw, and we then they fight us again, because I know those guys are close, then... Um, it's not going to be good. Okay, so what, what's the battle map? Seems okay, it's all just desolate. Sounds good. Alright, so... You hang back. Also, if we withdraw from this, some of the buildings in the horde will be damaged, but it's not really a big deal. Just get in there. Shoot them up as best you can. If things look like they're going to ship, withdraw. Okay, we'll just go straight to flaming shot. Ammunition-wise, we have got absolutely heaps. Yes, but it's a lot of Armenian spearmen. And they can be a pain in the ass. Whatever the case is, these guys will probably have to remain in Asia to recover afterwards. Okay, I want you to charge on in. Activate their skirmish ability so their cavalry comes after us. So take a few pot shots on them. Yep, and then pull back. Here we go. Seems to work every bloody time. Okay. Well, well, with the AI load. Come on, get out of that shit. Crap. Um, they did a bit of damage to us there. Desert Raiders. You guys need to move faster. Luckily, it wasn't these guys. Because they don't have that ability. Okay, they're eradicated, and if all they manage to do is get off a load of javelins, and that's job well done. And they're, yeah, they're gone. Okay, well I don't care about taking out the oh, desert levy. That might be even easier than Armenian archers. But I don't know their stats. They look pretty shit. Where are these guys even from? Are they from Egypt, roughly? Camel warriors don't concern me because they're slow. That's not doing much damage, just use standard shot. There's a lot of cavalry here. These guys aren't being particularly offensive considering they're attacking. These guys are definitely weaker than Armenian spears. Just looking at them, they are getting absolutely shredded. Game does not like it when I shoot a thousand arrows at once. Okay, here they come. These guys over here. Well, as long as they're coming in waves, that's the main thing. You can Pick them off bit by bit. So what are these? More desert marauders or whatever. Whatever the case is, shoot them. Their camels aren't going to be much of a concern. They can't reach us. They're too slow. Came all the way to the desert, up through Europe, through Iberia, Italy, Greece, and the dying con the ruins of Constantinople. You stupid shit. All right.
Alright, camel warriors, take him down. Oh shit, we're right near the red line now. The thing about camel warriors are, they're slow but they have a lot of hit points. Got some Persian mounted bowmen coming in over this way, and more Making desert raiders. Okay, let's start swinging around this way. Give us a bit more room to move out out here, because also that's the high ground, which is what I prefer to be shooting them from. What do we got here? Mercenary desert raiders. At least they're light troops. Can you go and take them down right now? Got a few shots on us. Ah, oh, crap. Right, you're gonna have to get into melee now. Crap, crap, crap. Not good. Oh, hang on, you guys can keep shooting. If you shoot that, come and break this. You're gonna need to get out of there. What's this? Desert Chieftain. God damn it, come on guys, get out of there. Well, it looks like we'll be recruiting some new units. Oh, good. Oh, hang on, that's not the main general. I won't worry about um, getting him off the battlefield. If he dies, he dies. Don't fault for not running fast enough. Okay, we got Persian scouts coming in. These guys are gonna block off our escape over here. We need to be moving around this way. Hurry up and finish them off. I don't care if they know I like this faction. Just hope they get a chance to use more of their ammunition before they die. Good. Ah, oh, crap. Come on, take out these bastards. Okay. Second uh, plan, we're actually going to have to come around this way again, because they don't have any melee troops down this way protecting it. Just need to get rid of this cab first. Okay, push forward. And change of direction. Yes, do try and annihilate them. I'm sure they're going to be a pain in the ass if we don't. So just save your ammunition. It's more important that we win. Ah, oh, it's too late. They're dead anyway. Okay. Okay. They're tired. They need a rest first. Before we try and break through this way. Just a quick one. Come on, get to... Oh, they, they started shooting. Come on. Hurry up, I need you to be fresher. Get over here. Okay, use the flaming shot, just a, just for a little bit. Make them scared. Okay, we don't actually want to get into melee. We're just trying to carve our way through this way. Get away from most of these units. Come on, shatter them, and then... Get away from them. You start making a run for it over here. Before they cut us off from here as well. Okay, go to standard shot now. Time to start shooting. Enemy units have rallied and returned to the battle. Oh, crap, these guys aren't going to let us get through here, are they? Well, maybe they will. So they broke, doesn't matter. Off you go, fuckheads. Probably be merging you later and just recruiting new ones. Okay, come on, get a 
across. Still haven't killed the main general, and they still have some camel warriors left. So maybe I shouldn't be wasting ammunition. All this desert crap. But I need to break through there. Okay, that's enough. Stop shooting. Save the rest of the... Excuse me. The rest of the ammunition for killing off these motherfuckers. Come on, you slowpoke. Get up. Get moving. Okay, that was pretty costly. You can see here that they absolutely peppered us with shots as we tried to get get away. But I'm confident now that we can we can win this. So that's why I didn't withdraw. Because they've lost their cavalry superiority. And if I can kill their general, well then, that's the end of them, really. These desert levia are not bloody as good as Armenian spears. And they won't hold up to me. Wait for it, maybe take a pot shot at him. I don't put them at fire at because I don't want them shooting at the other guys yet. Oh, that was shit. There we go. I want to see cooked camel for breakfast. Some camel warriors trying to catch up to the general by the looks of it. Well, that's no good. We'll have to put a stop to that. Okay, you guys are exhausted. Just wait. wait let them catch up to us. Not the other way around. They're not going to catch my general anyway because they're camels. They're certainly not for pursuing cavalry. If you, can't, if you can't get speed, that's why I don't like camels. You, you need speed and momentum. I mean, they might be good shock troops and heavy, lots of health, but if you fight the way I do, which is hit and run, they're not good at running, so... They're just all hit and no run. Plus, they stink like shit. Okay, that should be the end of their camels there. Okay, those that have used up their ammunition, you are now promoted to General's Bodyguard. Just stay over there. Now, we need to somehow get to this coward over here. Because until we kill him, um, well, we really can't go into melee with any of these guys. I mean, we might be able to break the occasional one of these guys, but it's not going to be anywhere near as good. There's not that many missile units. I think we should maybe get rid of them. Because we could go into melee with that guy if we needed to. Okay, use a few, few rounds on them. Okay, there's no more need for flaming shot until we get to this guy. pull back. Okay, what we need is two groups. So you, come with me, you're going to go around them. We've got to kill the enemy general. And you guys, you come in over here as a distraction. And who knows, he might come over this way. But if we split up, we got twice as good chance of catching the guy. You guys stay down there. Okay, I want you to run down these desert bowmen. 
Because they've left themselves out in the open. Gotta hurry. Okay, this guy's made himself a, a target. Just wait. No, get back, get back. Now's the time to be shooting him. Get the flaming shot. Where is it? There it is. They're broken anyway. They're not shattered, but they're... We need some damage to them. Alright, shoot him. Oh, I might have missed my opportunity there to actually kill the guy. So that's not much. The guy's mostly missed. It's okay, they're still not particularly focusing on us. Keep, uh, keep going around. You'll eventually get him. The guy's going to be trapped there if you're not careful. Up the hill. Careful, careful, don't go near these guys. You're getting shot by some of these archers. Don't worry about that too much. Gotta be aiming for the enemy general. This fuckers here are shooting at us. Motherfuckers. God damn it. Fucking prick. We almost had him and I fucked it up. Yeah, their archers are goddamn well protecting me. I can't even get close. Okay, we're gonna split up another group. Okay, I need you guys to keep shooting these desert bowmen because I need them gone. Okay, they're broken, but they're not shattered. Okay, you guys should be a charge into these desert hurlers. Okay, shoot the general. How are we going? Doing some damage? Not really. Come back. Crap, you guys, get out of there. Ah, oh, crap, get out of there. Need this again. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Some distance to move. Shoot the bastard. How's it going? I've killed only a handful of them. Come quickly down here. If he dies, we win. It's that simple. And you guys need to hurry up. These guys are just fed out of ammunition. Collectively, we should still have enough to get him, but we need all of our guys over there to help. Now that at least he's isolated. Try and lure him back over this way. Okay, good. Now you're in range of these guys. That being said, they don't have heaps of ammunition either. But these guys do. Oh crap, my guys here are exhausted. But I think he is as well. He's been running around a fair bit. There's not that many left of him. I'd be able to tell if they're dead because these guys would be shaken. not dead yet. Okay, he's dead. Because they're shaken. Alright, that means what we're going to do now, use up the last of our ammunition. I think we got shot a bit while trying to get down here. Okay, so split these guys up. Those that have ammunition into and to those that don't. You guys come over here. And you guys 
No more flaming shots needed, just go standard. Run down this motherfucker. The unit's ammunition is spent and it can no longer fire. I don't think all of them are shooting. There we go. Exhausted. That's okay. Pick up the pace. Don't forget to run them all down when you're there. What are these? Desert tribesmen? Whatever. Hurry up. I need you to come back and shoot these guys. Good, the battle is definitely turning in my favour now. With all these guys shaken, we could probably charge on in, but I'd rather use up all my ammunition first. And what's the point of getting that upgrade, those techs, if we don't make use of them? There's a few guys left with ammo. Just use it up and then we'll charge in. Just this guy has ammo left. Oh crap, that's a bit too close. So even then, it's only got like medium threat on there. Or I don't know. Because these guys aren't that strong. Alright, I'm not sure if we should just go charging in but I reckon we could get a mass route pretty quickly just be careful with the general all right we'll start with this unit here he's he's shaking he's looking a bit shit go take him down you guys come over here JC broke just on the foot and the Jesus Christ, they're weak as crap. Yeah, I absolutely smashed them. Yeah, take these guys. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Wait until you get into a proper formation. Let's not dick this around. Okay, now we've got no more ammunition apart from the general. He might as well use up his shit. stuff. Good, he's pretty much used it up. Alright, you guys aim me for these. You get the hell out of there. You take this down. Okay, I reckon that won't last very long. Good, then come and help down over here. Wasn't even needed. These guys have got nothing on our median spears. They're already wavering. Let's just go in. Fuck it, let's go. 
Cause chaos, guys. Break them all up. I reckon we can mass wrap these guys. Have some fun. Don't have to worry about anywhere near as much with, our, with these guys as Armenian spears. Cause chaos. Just break the shit out of them. This guy's shattering. The battle is turning in our favor. Already turned. I knew we could win it. We are moments away from victory. It all comes down to taking out their cavalry. You finish off the cavalry, then it's all good. I thought these guys here, though, they'd put up a bit more of a fight, but I guess they're really, really terrible. I won't worry too much about eradicating them entirely because. We're not even in the, near these guys' land. They'll just raise new armies. Could actually be better if we leave these guys in a bloody mess rather than eradicate them entirely. Because they'll have to go all the way home to get new units. Which is ages away. In fact, I might get there before them. Well, unlikely. I'll be busy taking out the Sassanids. Okay, that's enough. Close victory may be, but... We didn't have much else to do next turn, so we can go and have a rest in Asia. I'll take that. So they're not destroyed, but um, I don't think they're going to come bother us anytime soon. Alright, so... Suspicious death. Okay, it's just a warlord. That's no big deal. As long as they're not one of my generals. Good. Uh, who died? Oh, it was over here. Uh, what a shame. Thirsty for battle. Who is responsible for that? Rugians. All right. Who's, where are they? And they've only got the one region. Hmm. I do want to go to Britannia, but we can't let that go unpunished because these Britannians, they're not really, not really doing anything. Caledonians, I don't know. What else is over here? Unknown. So how many factions are left? 37, huh? Still a bit. Alright, and let's have a look at the situation. So it's winter now. Okay, I didn't realize it was going to be that snowy here. It doesn't really matter. We're in, we're in great shape. Thanks to them, mostly. They've started repairing that, so they paid a bit of money. Um, I still want to eradicate it. How's it going over here? Why are these guys raiding? Surely they're not going to make any money out of that. Um, I don't know. Maybe chase these da guys down just a little bit. If you can. I'm hoping Order of Resolve will just deal... Oh, it won't. Oh, hang on. Yeah, it will. Kind of makes me wish I had just maybe concentrate a bit more on getting rid of them, but whatever. And lost 21, that's good. Sword of my people. They must have gone and hired a whole bunch of, yeah, mercenaries. Still. 
I wouldn't be too concerned about them. Let's just come back into Asia and have ourselves a bit of a holiday. Okay, and over here, actually, I think the video has gone on for a little while, so we look to end this. Let's see, so there's a bit of winter going on here. Quite a few agents. Uh, where's, isn't this army that's up here? Is it the one that's able to recruit new champions, right? I think it's the only one. Still want to make sure I've got plenty of agents, because they seem to be soaking up a lot of the damage from enemy agents rather than my generals, and I prefer that so much more. Because I was getting a lot of those guys assassinated, and it was starting to really piss me off. Actually, it was really pissing me off. Alright, so, I'm going to see what's going on further out this way. So we've got assassinates out here, but they're taking attrition for some reason. It leads me to believe that maybe one of these re regions has some sort of plague. I, d I don't know. But them taking attrition is good for me. Who are these people? Macran. Ah, my sort of allies. Anyone that's at war with the Assassinids is a friend of mine for now. Now, Attila, I don't see any reason why you can't go and eradicate this for us. Oh, we can't auto resolve that. Well, fine, we'll fight it manually and then we'll end the video after that. Okay, so let's try to do this one quickly, because I know we're used up a lot of time already, and this one isn't going to be particularly interesting, but whatever. Okay, so, artillery, if you just want to go and get their attention, and then we'll handle it from there. First thing I want you to do, blow up this goddamn tower. Okay, they're coming out to fight. You guys are going to need flaming shot for those cavalry. Okay, we'll actually go out to meet them. Okay, you want to get out of there. Oh man. And they really wanted to get my, my uh, artillery straight away. We didn't manage to destroy this either. Oh, that fucking sucked. You guys suck. Fucking liability. You got these guys here killed trying to protect you. That's okay. If it's just this, then we, there's not much to worry about. Problem is, we didn't destroy the fucking tower. Oh, actually, yes, we did. It's burning. Okay, so that's all I wanted you guys to do. You can leave. Now we can actually get in close. Up close and personal, let's eradicate them. So we've got Pagan Bad, they're just about useless. So this is Assassinids, they own this settlement. Not for long. Soon it will be owned by fucking no one. And of course they wasted their only cavalry unit. Actually that was a pretty good thing what they did there. They just rushed on in there. I shot more of my own guys than of theirs. So we're taking a little bit of damage. There's pieces of shit buildings over here that are making it hard to maneuver properly. Get in there, but get rid of their goddamn archers before they shoot us again. Get their Kurds. Kurds always seem like a pretty elite detachment of units, though. Excellent at whatever they've been chosen to do. And yet they don't have their own state for some reason. Whatever. 
Come on, just, just, just hurry up. Hurry up and kill this bastard here. Who is he? Armenian Spears. We should be able to eradicate them easily. This is probably only slightly better than what auto resolve would have yielded, but whatever, still need to be done. Come on, kill the bastard. As soon as they're dead, these guys will probably break. Kill him. Or does he not actually have a general? Hmm. Yeah, he's the commander of the army, but he's not actually a general, so it doesn't actually affect him if we kill him. Hey, fuck off! Let's go kill those bastards. Winkle suck it, pieces of shit. I don't even know what Winkle is. But they fucking suck it! Break them so we can get out of here. We're done. We're done. That could have gone better. Could have gone worse. Whatever. Actually, kills wise, that wasn't too bad. Okay, cool. And suck it first and I don't know. Should we settle for the turn? I'll think about it. I'll probably raise it down to the ground. Yeah, there's nothing else around here. Raise it. And that's another Sassanid settlement going up in flames. Did we need to head over there now? Well, whatever. That's the end of this episode. So guys, like and subscribe. Part 51's next. And don't forget to visit me on Facebook. See you next time. Fuckers.